I'm going to be honest with you all out there. I normally would not react to something like this because I'm not going to lie. I'm not a huge fan of Marilyn Monroe. But it's already Oscar talk. And the movie has not even came out yet. It trips me out when they try to predict how good a movie is going to be before it actually even comes out. And I heard the actress that's playing the role of Marilyn Monroe, she's a good actress. I'm going to have to check this out and see for myself. I'm pretty sure it's just going to be a sneak peek trailer. I don't know if it's for a sneak peek. I'm not sure. This is the first time that I'm watching it. Like I said, I didn't even have no clue this movie was coming out. And I'm not a fan of Marilyn Monroe. I mean, I like the fact how she overcame a lot of things in her life that probably would of made any regular person just break down and just forget about life but I heard a lot went on behind closed doors and I'm pretty sure this movie is going to bring all that to light but before we get into that what up YouTube it's your boy RDS saying last But it is one thing I hope they do. That iconic scene when she's standing over, I don't know, some steam or something, a fan blowing at her. And she got the white dress on. That's an iconic scene. I hope they show that in the movie. I know y'all know what I'm talking about. I think that's Marilyn Monroe. So if it's not, hey, it is what it is. I'm not perfect. I'm just a reactor, you know what I'm saying? We mess up sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, let me stop playing. Let's get on to this shit, y'all. It's called Blonde. Let's go. Please come. Don't depend on me. She's coming. There you go. There you go. Already. Okay, it gave you a little bit, I guess. But at least I get to, I had seen my scene that I was talking about. She's standing over with the white dress and it's blowing. That's iconic. Everyone knows about that. Who doesn't? You don't even know, even have to know who she is by name, but you know that scene. You know that everyone knows that, have seen that at least once in their life. On a commercial, in a movie, everyone. And I believe um, Heath Ledger's wife portrayed her as well. I might be wrong on that, too. Um, I'm not sure what her name is. Like I said, I'm not that good. I mean, I am good with a lot of actresses and actors' names, but some of them, you know. But I heard, yeah, she did a film based on that character, and she did pretty good in it. I don't think she won no type of awards or anything, but I heard she did pretty good in that. So hit me up in the comments and let me know what y'all think of Blonde. And if y'all think whoever's portraying that character, she's going to do a good job. I'm not sure. I don't even know how good an actress she is. I don't remember seeing her in any movies. But like I say, once again, I might be wrong on that. So definitely hit me up and let me know any other movies that she starred in. And if y'all think she's going to be great in that role. Like I said, it was an okay trailer and give you much. I knew it was going to be some type of sneak peek trailer. So we gotta wait for the full trailer. And September, that's a nice little time away, so I'm pretty sure we're gonna get another trailer before that. Netflix, y'all, uh, they they been on point lately. I don't know what's going on. They prices is high. Fucking $21 to keep that fucking Netflix account. I damn near said fuck that shit. They go up again. I don't know. I might be opting out of that shit. For real. I ain't gonna be playing paying no more than what I'm paying now for Netflix. But as always, you already know how we do it. 
hit that subscribe button click that bell y'all until next time peace love and y'all finish that for me